Now then guys, welcome to Strauss Gaming, I'm Lou. This is Season 8, Episode 14 I think now, uh, of my Leicester City Let's Play in Football Manager 2018 and we're getting to the back end of the season now. Uh, I'm going to be showing you in the next couple of episodes every game we've got left, there's four of them, potentially five. Um, so yeah, today we've got West Ham, West Ham, Man City and West Brom. Um, hopefully we'll have a good game. Fingers crossed. We have a couple of problems with injuries. Uh, indeed, he is out. He's going to miss this game. I don't know why I've just clicked on transfers. Tactics. I'm going to take off Scott. I'm going to go a bit. Erlingard's going to start this match. Bounce forward. Do that. Bounce forward. Um, so I'm going to go standard because it's told me to go standard and Man City tore us apart last time. And maybe just try and retain possession and just play our football. Change things up just a little bit. Might give Ben Chilwell a start. Um, TT, you're going to have to play every game. Conditioning-wise, we're not looking that great, to be honest with you. Um, but we'll just have to make do with what we've got. Um, yeah, so let's get into this game. So today, obviously, yeah. I've already said what we're doing today, so let's play. Usual holding Zuma and Maguire in the back four with Silver and goal. TT Chilwell, then Tucson. Oh, I haven't changed his bloody position, have I? What he's doing. He needs to be a ball winning midfielder. And I'll change that in a second. So uh, let's go. Come on, lads. Let's keep this one going. I should have just said take revenge, actually. But let's just do this way. Do that and then. Ball winning midfielder, please. Let's just keep going. Right. Can we get the victory? At least in a way goal. That's what we want. Right, we're 10 minutes into this game. And not a lot has happened. If you look at the stats, Man, uh, Man City have had three shots. We've had none. They've had all the possession. We've got a yellow card with Winks. Other than that, nothing else has happened. This is going to be a nice ball in first half, I think. All right, Winks has been booked. Yeah, we know Winks has been booked. All right, half an hour mark. Apparently, we're looking poor right now. We can't find any of our passes. Okay, let's just let them score a goal. For God's sake, we're 1-0 down. This Leicester team are struggling at the minute. We really are struggling. Right. Stupid set piece. Right, Zuma winks. Maguire. Chilwell. Erdingard. To TT. Can we get. Oh, TT loses out. What's that all about? Right, Hazard. To Akadi. This Man City team, by the way, is absolutely class. I don't understand how they're not doing that well in the league. Deli Alley. Akadi. Do not let them score a second. Right, do you know what? We need to go attacking. We're not literally in this game at all. We've not even had a shot, which is not like us. Dolberg, Abraham are just not having any of the ball, so their ratings are down. We're just not performing. We're really not performing. Winks with the uh, yellow card already. It could be worse, though. We still haven't had a shot. We haven't had a shot for the whole of this half. What the hell is this all about? How How can we not have a shot? Just gonna get all aggressive up in their ass and tell them, come on. We're throwing our season away massively. And they just want me to do another season, don't they? That's what it is. Right, Erdengard with a free kick hits the crossbar. Erdengard's in again, loses out. Acardi's got it for Manchester United now, and they're on the attack. No, that's the end of the highlight. The front two are absolutely just having an app. That's just a shambles. Chris Scott, you can come on for Dolberg. It's not going to make any difference. Chris Scott will come on and just have a poor game as well. Right, TT. Throwing deep, deep into our half. Ball up to Abraham. Wins the ball to Winks. Winks looks for Scott, but it's not there. Why? And we let them have a long shot. So at least we've had a shot, guys. That's uh, a promising sign, right? Ah, right, what to do? 
Winks is not having a great game. Dan Hall, come on, lads. Why is he looking? What's up with him? Why is he on a downer? Why is, is morale poorly? 16. Is that because I shouted at half time? Did he get scared of me? Not Dan Hall, come on. Become a superstar overnight for us. It's probably stressed because I'm playing him in these big games. What, a semi final of the Europa League? You've just come through the youth system at, in March and you can bang straight into the first team. Probably not how you should do it. This is just going to be a repeat of the last game that we played against them. When, uh, do, 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 do. Abraham's having a bit of a poor game. Might do that. Two something goes a ball in a midfielder. And then I'll bring McCule on. Put Scott in the middle. It's a Calero. Right, go. This is a makeshift team now, isn't it, guys? Right. Change has been made. Conditioning wise, we look like we're about to like die. 59%, 63%, 66%. Not looking good, are we? And I think we're going to lose this one, 1-0. One what can I do tactics-wise? Can I encourage them? Yes, let's get them encouraged. Let's just get that ball into the box. Let's go route one. Let's close them down a lot more. Get stuck in. Let's just try and, try and get a ball. Try and get a goal. I don't know why we've got pumped the ball into the box now, because we've only got one striker on the pitch who's going to be in there. And Chris Scott. Right. Highlight to us, Erdengard to Tucson to Chilwell. It's back to goal, though. That's the problem. Can he get a pass off? No, he's just going to lose the ball. And now they're going to come out on the attack. And I think they're going to score again. No, they're not. See, that annoys me. He could have just passed it back. I'm, I'm pointing to the screen. You couldn't see. He could have just passed it back here uh, to our defender. But he just kept on hold of it and then just lost it. And let's just close them down. Probably going route one is now going to cost us. A card is in here, hits the post. We, Man City should be what at least three nil, three nil up with the uh, clear cut chances they've had. Um, right, Zuma, big ball. We need this away goal, but I don't think we're going to get it. We've hardly lost all season, and then it comes to the back end, the business end of the season, and then we lose loads of games. Full time, 1 0 again against Manchester City. We're making it difficult for ourselves. We are making it difficult for ourselves massively. Why did you have a good game? Ah, oh, shut up. Why are you looking to vote, mate? I'm going to have to have a team meeting. I don't like having team meetings. <sighs> right. I need to rest the team. That's what I need to do. Right, guys, I'm going to rest the team. And then we're going to do the West Brom game. Wish me luck. Right, guys. So here we are for the West Brom game. Away from home. Manchester United won their game early on, 3-0. So no pressure on us. Um, how's the team looking conditioning-wise? I may start Martin instead of Maguire. Let's give him a chance. Um, and then we're going to put McQuell on the bench, maybe. Martin's having... He had such a good season last season. And he's not really played that much... This geez, only a two start. He's, he's on a downer, really. If you have a look, played 31 games for us last season. This season, he's played six. <laughs> um, but this this kid's better though, isn't he? Yeah, this kid's better. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna play this kid instead, Miguel instead of Martins. Let's give uh, Harry Maguire an old rest. Uh, and that that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, indeed, he's back. Well, not back. He's returning to injury full fitness soon he's wanted by Barcelona as all people we're still on standard though so I'm just going to read this match I should really go out and just try and win it go on that attack get a load of goals but at the minute the way our way our look is going look at the morales dropping a little bit we're favorites okay they're kind of like that I don't I just don't want to stress them out too much there's a lot of football to be played the next few games. Well, four. Four games, but they're all important games. Especially Man City next as well. 
we win this game, we're going to go. Obviously, we've got a game in hand on Ma Manchester United, but the fact we're coming up to the 90 point mark and not winning the league is going to be ridiculous. Right, zoom in, McCule. Right, McCule's in. Finds a pass to Dolberg. Dolberg finds Abraham, who then scores. Gets in. That's what we like to see. Nice football for ourselves. Oh, nice early goal. McCule plays it into Dolberg, who plays a lovely, lovely pass to Tammy Abamiam. Abamiam? Abraham. Why do I always get his name wrong? And I thought it was just going to square it in the middle for McCule. He doesn't. And that's what we wanted, a nice early goal. 92 points were on for this season. The highest points total, I think, in Leicester City's history. I don't think they got that many points when they won the league. It was only 80-odd, wasn't it, when they, when they won it back in 2016. Right, highlight to West Brom. Hopefully we win this back. We do. Miguel tries to clear it, finds Abraham, who loses out, and now West Brom are on the attack. And where are West Brom in the league? They're, they're 11th, so just smack bang in the middle of the table. Not for anything really to play for, and they've just scored. For God's sake, what is with this team? Obviously, getting them into the top 10 position would be better for them financially. We're going to go attacking, though. Um, we can't really afford to lose this game. We can't give Man, Man United some, some hope. We need to just be on their heels constantly. We need to win this game. We need to... Hopefully, let hopefully they lose that game in hand. But I don't think they will. The playing teams that we're playing around about now, um, we've all played the top six, top eight. We've all played them. So now it's I think we've got Everton as the last game of the season. Who are in twelfth? The fact we're not winning this game now, just need to g myself up a little bit. I need to get a little bit, a little bit more out of this game. Like Tucson is not having a great game. Let's just. It's fine. I'm not going to go in too hard at them. But we can still win this. Uh, they look switched off, for God's sake. I'm just telling them we can still win it and then they switch off. Right, go. We need to... Um, McCure's not having a great game, is he? Do we go with three up front? This works. I'll probably do that in in a little some minutes, depending on how McCure does here. McCure looking for the pass, doesn't find him, but Chilwell's in, finds the cross, but it's a bit too high. Dolberg cannot get on that one. Right, there's an injury to their goalkeeper, which is, I was going to say, always nice to see. It's not nice to see an injury. Uh, and I am going to take off McCure. I'm going to bring on Chris Scott. Do what I normally do. Bring him in the middle. Go. Complete forward. And then I'm going to just go more direct. Because that seems to work. See if we can grab a goal. The annoying thing is this goal difference thing. But they've got a corner now. Can we defend the corner? Yes, we do. Silver's there with the, uh, with the strong hands. Toussaint is just playing poor at the minute. They're going to score. The, the, we're giving them all the chances. What's wrong? We were a nice attacking team like a few months back, scoring goals left, right and centre. Um, our attack, attacking players are just like outperforming everyone in the league. But yet, we just seem to be struggling at the minute. And again, there's Dolberg hitting the post and now they're coming back out at us. Miguel just, Miguel just puts it out. That's what we need. Um, Tucson's not having a great game, is he? Erdingard. Can you play in the midfield? You can. Go as an attacking playmaker. Right, Dolberg looking for Scott. Doesn't find him. Dolberg wins it. Scott's in here to square it. Someone score. Scott should have squared that or at least scored, for God's sake. Right, sub has been on, Erdingard is now on. What can I shout at them? Show some passion, go out there and win this game. 
Erdengard wins that ball nicely, right? Dolberg in, finds Scott, shoots and scores. Chris Scott, thank you very, very, very much. We're now back into the lead. Oh my God, this is just, I'm not enjoying this end of this season. I tell you now, I'm not enjoying it. All right, Chris Scott picks the ball up. This time does score. Again, he still could have squared it to Abraham, but no, he does it himself. Oh, get in. Right, what am I going to do now? Do you know, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to take Chilwell off and bring on Hernandez. Because he seems to be doing really well. TT has been just solid for us recently. 65% on his conditioning. Right, 10 minutes to go. Come on, guys. Let's get this win. Eighty-five, eighty-six minutes. Just want the win now. I just goal difference is just out of it. Right, hold in. Do not let them score. Do not let them score here now. Right, silver. So we need Man United to lose because we we're not getting the goal difference back. We're really not. We're not going to beat Everton eight 0 are we? This game's not over yet. So I've just got to control for the last couple of minutes. Uh, this highlight's just not ending. Erdegaard to Theo. Big ball over the top. Erdegaard's in. Scott's in again. Chris Scott just very, very poor from him then. Short pass and retain possession. Is the time racing on? Nope. Let's just try and control this. Control this game now. Let's just see it out. Right, five added minutes. Come on, Dolberg, win the header. He does. TT winks. Plays it to Abraham, to Scott. He's looking for Dolberg, but Dolberg just didn't read it. Didn't make his run, and now they are on the attack. Can we get that back? We can. Erdengard. Well done. Dolberg's in. Loses out. Dolberg, what are you doing, mate? Right, TT there. Erdengard. Dolberg crosses it. Abraham's in. Abraham scores. There we go. That. Shores things up. 3-1. We're going to win this game. We're top of the table by three points. Man United do have a game in hand on us and they've got a better goal difference. Erdengard, I tell you what, he's looked good in this midfield role. As an, uh, an advanced playmaker. He may, he may start against Man City in that role. Only a 6.9 rating, but I think he's looked good since he's... Come on, right. Win the header. We can. Well done, Abraham. Right. Do not concede. Do not concede a goal. Silver picks the ball up nicely there. Right, Miguel to Theo. To Winks. To Theo. To Abraham. And we lose out. I think that's the problem with having three up front, though, and you're trying to play shot trying to keep possession because you don't have anyone in that final third bit really to pass to because we've only got the two midfielders it's a bit hard to keep possession but we do win that 3-0 eventually it was a tough game but a very nice victory they all seem delighted they all seem happy right that is another win in the bag so two more games left of this season potentially um oh my god when when did man united play When's their game in hand? They've got to play. Senior squad. So they've got West Brom on the 16th. Blackburn on the 18th. Hopefully they win the Champions League semi-final leg and they just think they want to focus on the Champions League and play a week aside. I don't know. Oh my God, guys. Right. Two games left. Potentially three if we beat Man City in the next episode but we'll see so we've got manchester city and everton next for the end of the season thank you for watching guys and i'll catch you in the next one i'll see you in a bit